Hey there, Coin Metallurgist here. Um, and uh, this video is uh, me looking through uh, the first thousand dollars of half dollars uh, up in Idaho. Um, I'm starting this video about halfway through uh, the bag of half dollars. It had a thousand in it, a thousand dollars, two thousand of these half dollars. Um, so far, uh, I haven't had very much luck. I found a few uh, pretty nice condition coins, um, uh, but just to give you an idea of what I'm looking for to pull out of here, I'm looking for a 1964 or earlier half dollars um, that would be 90% silver, um, 1965 through 1970 half dollars, uh, which are 40% silver. Um, th there might be a few stray, uh, unlikely, but stray uh, 1971 uh, through 4S uh, half dollars that are 40% silver uh, from the the Blue Ike and Brown Ike sets that got put into circulation. That's not very likely. Um, I mean, in that same realm, there could be uh, half dollars from uh, silver proof sets that got put into circulation, um, but th that's also extremely unlikely. Um, the other thing is that after uh, 2002, uh, the U.S. hasn't made um, half dollars for circulation. They've only made enough for collector's purposes. So uh, the amount that they have made has gone down considerably. So if I found any half dollars in here that were newer than 2002, I'd probably keep them just because they're, they haven't made very many of them. Um, I'll finish going through these um, and then I'll finish this video. And uh, just remember, I'm going to be going through uh, another 2,000 uh, half dollars um, that come from rolls rather than a bag. So hopefully those ones will have better results. Um, still hopeful that there might be something silver in here, though. I'll finish up this video here in a minute. Okay, so I have uh, finished going through uh, the thousand, first thousand dollars of half, half dollar coins that came from this bag. Uh, from the bank up here in Idaho. Um, throughout this video I've been talking about, uh, or at least I mentioned it a couple times, how 2002 uh, or newer, um, they haven't made very many of those coins because they only made enough to uh, satisfy the collector's needs. Um, and I think a couple times I was saying newer than 2002, but I mean to say including 2002, 2002 or newer. So I didn't find any of those in here, none that were newer than 2002. So don't be keeping any of those. Um, the 2001 coins, which are the newest coins that are in here, uh, there were a couple that are in really good condition, but uh, I'm still not gonna keep those. And I found uh, some uh, bicentennial half dollars that are in really good condition. Um, but the thing is that they made you know, ridiculous amounts of this this year of the 1976 ones. So I don't really see any need in keeping that. So, um, you know, uh, as far as my records go, uh, I didn't find any silver in this uh, in this bag. You know, look at this coin. You see this white rim on this, and it looks silver. And this was the coin that I had seen in in the bag before I opened it. Uh, and thought that there might have been a silver coin in here. Um, but the problem is this is a 1971D, and there's no way there'd be a 1971D that's silver. Um, so, you know, I saw that, and it's, you know, I think, how can it be, you know, so white on the rim like that if it's not silver? Um, and, you know, I weighed it with the scale, and it doesn't weigh enough to be silver. Uh, even 40% silver, it's the it's just a little bit too light um, and you know looking on the internet what it might be is that someone might have uh, plated it in silver at one point and that plating may have you know came off here on the front and the back it doesn't look plated at all but here on the edge it still looks like it's got that silver color to it um, you know but I'm fairly confident that this coin isn't silver um, if you think otherwise find these coins and go find it because I'm throwing it back in. <laughs> um, so, uh, like I said before, 
I'll be looking through another $2,000 of half dollars in addition to a bunch of other coins up here in Idaho to look for silver uh, out of circulation. Um, and we'll see what we can find. I hope you enjoyed this video uh, and uh, look forward to uh, watching the other ones. Thanks.